Okay guys, it is that time. I'm gonna do the tires on my car using my phone. Because my GoPro was pretty dead. So yeah. We got those LED lights in my car, but only the ones that did not. There was only four fuse lights. So all so the ones in my car are all fuse lights. But they're pretty cool. We put a couple of the normal ones in my dad's front truck and my dad's truck. They work beautiful. It's time to do the tires. I think we'll keep the two fronts for good spares. They're good spare tires. So. There's that. I'm gonna do the. Oh, take all the. Okay, I do got my tripod. It's in my car, I think. Nope, right there. Unless you put it back in there. Where is it? Oh. Might as well. Oh, I need to, yeah, yeah, I need to raise this up a little bit. And it's cranker. Oh, there's that. Okay. What size is it? 21. 21, maybe? Yes, I think it is. Yeah. Hard to... What are you doing? See the flat spot? Yeah. See how it goes down? Yes. But they're still good spare tires even though they got flat spots on them. They're good burnout tires. No. Well, I don't know. They're good spares. I only use them for spares. Okay. will be a better video than those headlights or the interior lights okay I'm gonna wheel this tire over to the machine one by one let me get my camera in good position all right well my dad's waiting on me so I'm gonna roll this sucker over Is the compressor on? Yeah. Oh yeah, I heard it running. I guess I would just film me taking the tires off and then go to the tire machine. Tire number two. Can't really tell if there's a flat spot in this. Yeah, I need to get a caliper. Okay. What can I do? 
these are my tires. Take the weights off. How do I do that with the weight taker off? You want me to go ahead and put it on the balancer? Just slide it on there. Take the weights off all of them. Hey, take the valve stems out. Not that one. No. Take the valve, valve cores oh. off. Yeah. Front room, we can save those, of course. You want to go ahead and put the one this tie on the balancer? Oh, yeah, just take the weights off. Oh, where are the weights? Right here? Yeah. And then put them. What's the proper way to take them off? Weight tool. I yeah, gave it to you. I never took them off before, Dad. You're acting like I did it a lot of times. <clears throat> Do I just have to squeeze it or something? Yeah, see where the the, the pointy part is? Yeah. Go one. into the hole, the weight yeah. on the rim. Here. Look. Every weight has a hole in it. See the hole? Hole. in it. Well, we might use those. I don't know. Whatever it takes. Alright, now put it on the balancer. Do I need to put this black thing on before I put it that metal thing on? Uh, That's what, because I put the yes. Okay. You gotta find the right cone for it. Well, I'll see if this one will work. You gotta put, make sure the cone fits in the hole. The little part. Let me show you. Hold on. Yeah. I never really did this.
is a cone here. Make sure that's the right one and it is. Okay. Down there like that. Another the cone. This actually goes like this. So, how, what information does the tire need this rotated or found? Okay. And you gotta plug it in. Yeah, of course. I'm gonna go to the tire machine balancer now. Okay, sometimes it says, and these are 16 by 7. See, look. It says right here 16 by 7. Okay, which one is it? It's a 16 inch rim. Okay. First, you gotta. Do this measurement here. You push that button. It's this right here. You go here to here, and you got 195. Okay, so do you want to put that? So you go to 195. Yep. And you go to this measurement. What's that one? Six, uh, seven. Seven. Yep. Seven inches wide. So okay. Seven, and then you go to this one. And of course, it's set for the. Sixteen. And then when you fill it out, it's already okay. filled out for the other tires. Yep. Now close the the door. And hits. Oh, it starts all the way. Okay. Fifty-fifty. Okay. So. Now I see. I you see your knob here for your light. Yes. You gotta go to the arrow. Oh. Okay. Go to the arrow. Then you gotta get a half inch. Where's the, your tool? Oh. Oh, the weights tool? Yeah. Right here. Okay, you gotta get a 0 .50, which is that guy there, that's a 0 .50. Okay. Right Hard to read. Well, you got, you got labels. I think that's a point two five. You got labels. That's point. That's a one, one five. Unless they're in the wrong. That's a point five right there. All right. So you take, you see this line here? Yeah. You got a line. Your, make sure you let your green lights on, your green arrow. Okay. You basically line the weight up with that line and go to the rim. Okay? Yep. Okay. There's that one. And then we got to close it again. Nope. So nope. you got to do the other side first. Oh, oh. Green arrow. And then I get another point five. Mm. What did you do with the other weights? Oh, uh, it's over there. Go grab them, because they might be point five. Well, I just, well, there's only one over here. This one is... I, Let me see. I think this one's 7.5, maybe. Or point seven five. Or point seven. Well, I don't know. Yeah, it's 0.75. That's that one right there. That's 0.75. One point five. Point five, right there. There we go. Okay, so now we're now the same thing. You got to line this up with the center. Mm-hmm. And go straight up. Okay. Yep. That. Okay. Put the hood back down. You should read all zero. Yep. There we go. Balance. That's what we want. There you go. I saw a video on how to balance tires too. So <laughs> I'm trying to just get a little idea on my stone. So it would back ones different, or are they the well? So, everyone's yeah. the same. 
So all I need to do. You don't have to set it up anymore either. So all I need to do is put this tire on and get, and then just shut the lid. All right, we got one tire ready to go. Yep. Put them up there. So remember, you gotta make sure the clone goes in the center. Yep. Do you think I should uh, do the rest of the tires in fast speed? It does. So this is kind of the tricky part. Put the tire on. Most of the time. So we just like to use our knee here to help you keep it propped up. Never been very good at putting tires on, but. So you just gotta kind of use your whole leg, get it in one hole. It takes a little bit. There we go. Get the hubcaps on. Or get all the lug nuts started. Yeah, you guys are seeing one tire is normal speed, and all the others are going to be fast, but putting one tire back on, it's going to be normal. Well, this one, I'll just go a little... Okay. Now let's get them snug just a little bit and then we'll check them all. Put the hubcap on. You gotta gotta just line it up where the uh, things go. I don't know if the batter's on this. Oh, one tire's on. Yeah, that's how much I've been working. I got dirty hands now. Let's go back to the beautiful tire machine.
Well, I, got, I hope you guys enjoyed that fast speed, but I didn't put the other one on because this is the caliper that needs replaced, so that'll be a different video also. Sticking a little bit, but here you guys are.